What is up, y'all? It's the Eric B, your stream teacher here. And if you've watched any of my older videos or watched my streams like you should at twitch.tv slash the Eric V, you might know that I use Streamlabs OBS as my primary and pretty much only open broadcasting software or broadcasting software because the OBS part was kind of stolen, which is the point that OBS had to make on Twitter today, as well as Lightstream has been stolen from by Streamlabs with a little bit of their marketing as well as their user experience. So because I've been feeling left out of using plugins and having a lighter CPU load, I've been wanting to use OBS instead of Streamlabs OBS for quite a while now. And I think that now's as good a time as any to do that. As I do that, I'm going to let you watch the process from what I've seen. It looks like it's very easy. So as I am the stream teach, this doesn't mean I am exempt from stream learning. So what we're going to do is see how hard it is or how easy it is to get all my stuff out of Streamlabs OBS into OBS and use that for the foreseeable future. Class is in session. So as you can see, we are here in Streamlabs recording a video as I always record my videos as of today. But what we're going to do first is check the names of our scenes here. And I know one of mine is named video, one of mine is named live, one's for YouTube, one's for Twitch. So what we're going to do is import the live one because that's what I use for Twitch. So here we have OBS and what we're going to do is click on scene collection and then we are going to click on import. Now, I have not done this step again. This is what I made clear in the intro. So hopefully this works. But before we even go further, I do want to address something that happened to me. OBS had a pop up that said, do you want to have OBS detect other possible streaming software that you may use and import from there? I accidentally clicked cancel. Well, I clicked it on purpose, but I clicked it because I wanted y'all to see the process of me clicking on that pop up. However, because I clicked off of it, it didn't come back. So if you somehow don't get that pop up when you click on scene collection and import, all you have to do is go to file settings. And then if you're on the general menu, on importers, search known locations for scene collections when importing. And that's what lets OBS look in those common third party folders to find stuff like Streamlabs OBS and maybe even uh, OBS.live. But I'm not sure about OBS.live, I've never used it. But anyway, we're gonna click on scene collection and as we can see, it has detected a lot of stuff from Streamlabs. So what I'm gonna do is look for something named live and there it is. And I'm going to see if the importing works. And I'm very nervous, actually. OK, and then what I'm going to do is click on. Ooh, didn't seem to work. Oh, you know what? Let's try it one more time. But let's actually click on the checkbox that says live and then let's click on import and see if it works. And then let's click on scene collection and then let's click on the word live. And then we have just chatting PC gaming. We have all my scenes and my, my joints are popping up my, you know, my, I don't know what you call them anymore. <laughs> anyway, they appear to be working. I'm also noticing that my stinger transition came over when I click to a different scene. Boom, it does do it. So we are looking pretty good. It seems very easy. It seems um, almost too easy to the point where I wonder why I took so long to do this. But now if you were waiting, you don't have to wait any longer because you know what to do. There's only a few steps and we've completed them. So what we're going to do is record my outro using OBS Studio instead of Streamlabs. I feel like my potential is unlocked. And what's cool about that is as I learn more about OBS, I can teach more about OBS. So I'm pretty excited for the future of streamer school. 
and i cannot wait to give this a run during a live stream tomorrow at 6 30 p.m eastern time but anyway if this video helped you out or if you think it'll help somebody else out feel free to like the video and share it with them and if you want to see more of me you can join the discord you can of course subscribe and join me on twitch and of course if you have any questions about what i went through in this video feel free to leave a comment that's it audio is added and everything i'm very pleased y'all class dismissed i'm a great hurdler i can knock out hurdler right now for you hurdler like he hurdles that's what he was saying <laughs> i hate this show oh god hurt i'm a great hurdler